Hello, mate. You haven't shaved. So? Gentleman's prerogative for the Sunday. Well, it's Saturday, Mike. Oh, is it? Well, it's even better. Hey, fetch a few jars later. I suppose so, if you like. I'm looking forward to it. I tell you what, I've grafted very hard this week. You want to try it sometime. It's as if yesterday never even happened. I don't know what freaks me out more. Days like this would kill him. Lee, if I put him in that care home, mate, he'd hate me for it. Yeah, and the next day, he wouldn't even remember who you were. <sighs> Look, besides, he doesn't even know what day it is. He thinks he's been grafting hard all week. I mean, is that, is that what passes for normal? I need a stiff drink. I've been shanghaied into Norris's party. Fancy it? No fear. Don't worry, mate. When it comes to Dutch courage, you can't beat the scotch. And this is a little belter. What do you reckon? Mm. Oh, and I thought I was smooth. Oh. <laughs> Thirty-year-old is that. Twenty-year in cask, ten in bottle. I was saving it for a special occasion, but I thought, well... Michael will appreciate that. Thirty years old, eh? Mm-hmm. I reckon that's aged almost as well as me. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Mm. Oh, that's what makes life worth living. That and a good quality cigar. Don't forget the skirt and all. Oh, they've given me nothing but trouble. There's only two of them been worth a hangover. But friends, I've been very lucky there. We've had some good times, haven't we, Fred, eh? You have on golf course. And I've never met a more gracious loser. Yeah. <laughs> May it continue for a long, long time. Yeah. Mm. Put another one in there, Fred. We might as well finish that now the bottle's open. <laughs> You'd never guess they were out wrong. It's a lottery, Fred. Days like these, nearest we're going to get to a win. He's enjoying himself, mate, and so should we. Come. Time that well, didn't you, son? Get me and your dad a drink, will you? Same again, Sean. Yeah. How you are, Mr. B? What's he doing here? Well, he fancied a drink. Everyone's entitled to a last request or something. You what? Well, who knows if he's going to be fit enough to get in here again? Nothing's changed. I still want him with me. We can look after him round the clock if need be. Have you stopped using this and tried using this for a second, boy? Because if you had, you would see it's a suicide mission. End of your life as you know it. Don't you worry about that. Ten, twenty years maybe caring for a man who won't thank you for it. I tell you something, he despise you. But you're willing to do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll check this time. Oh, it's lovely. I'm not sure this is the right place for him. Maybe not, but uh, I bet he'll be there soon enough, so at least he deserves us a few drinks to see him on his way, eh? How do you mean? I'm going to ring the care room tomorrow, so as soon as they've got a place for him. Does he know? <laughs> do you think he'd be grinning all over his boat if he did? How do you tell someone something like that, Kenny? Eh? I had trouble telling myself. You've no other choice. People will understand. Just, just keep it under your hat, eh? Well, I'm sure his friends all want to... Say goodbye. No, no, no. Not at all. Make him visit him. You know, he'll be around for a long time yet. I just don't want tonight to be awake. Yeah, I want him to have a... I just want him to have a good time. How are you feeling, mate? It's Saturday night. I've got Fred's best malt inside me. I am flying! Mm. So, um, how long was this party then? Because you weren't gone long. Oh, were we now? Seemed like an awfully long night to me. Long, I say long. Nanook of the North had shorter nights. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why people round here have house parties when we've got this place at the end of the street. Here, yeah, yeah, this is like my front room, this is. In fact, I've been happier here than I have in my own flat sometimes, and it's all down to you lot, so what are you going to have? Oh. After that testimonial, give over. Drinks are on the house. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice. oh, no, not for me, son. One pink elephant's enough. Never mind three. Don't mind if I have a snifter? Nah, help yourself. Whew, I wish I had your stamina. Oh. Must be getting old. Leave it out. He drank Fred under the table. And Jamie looked a bit on the rope beside and all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he did, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, do you know what? What? I really enjoyed tonight. Yeah, me too. Great, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. You know, we need to... No, yeah, we need to do it again. You, me and Jamie. 
The Baldwin boys painting a town. Yeah, right. There's no easy way to say this. I know, you don't want to go on the town with an old crock. Well, that is charming. No, that's not what it is at all. I wasn't going to say that. I've really had a great night. But it's not how things are, is it, Mike? Hmm? You know, um... Do you remember that care home we visited? Oh! With Jamie? Oh, yeah. That place! God! I can still smell it! <laughs> Hang on a minute. You promised me... Mike, Mike. It's not what I want. But you're seriously ill, Michael. Look at me, Mike. I'm only trying to do what's best for you. Believe me. You believe me, don't you? I do. Yeah, I do. I trust you, Danny. If you think it's best I shall go in there, then, then I will. Last thing I want to be is a burden. Well, you've never been that. Thanks. I've always stood on my own two feet. I've, I've, I've built everything up with my own two hands. All right, I've been written off a couple of times, yeah, but... I promise you this, son. One sunny day, I'm going to walk through the gates of that place as right as rain. Mike. It ain't like that. You can't. Yes, I can! I've beaten the odds all my life. I'm going to beat this. You watch me. Good night, son.